The Israeli army has been carrying out secretive ground operations to destroy Hezbollah infrastructure in Lebanese villages close to the border for the past year, military spokesman Rear Admiral Daniel Hagari said Tuesday. The military released footage of what it said were Israeli soldiers uncovering tunnels and weapons in at least three Lebanese villages. Hagari said that the current ground maneuvers in Lebanon are an expansion of the previous year's operations. He said that troops destroyed more than more than 700 Hezbollah sites, including tunnels carved deep into the hillside. They included separate rooms for storing weapons and what seemed to be bedrooms outfitted with mattresses. Hagari said that Hezbollah was preparing to carry out an October 7-style attack against Israel, based on the placement of weapons slicks and maps uncovered during operations that refer to a plan called, Conquer the Galilee. RPG 7, RPG 29, the machines of them. Yes, the RPG is the robot. Yes, the Heavy smoke was seen rising over southern Lebanon's skyline on Monday following Israeli strikes. The Lebanese health ministry said at least 105 people were killed around the country in airstrikes on Sunday. Two strikes near the southern city of Sidon, about 45 kilometers south of Beirut, killed at least 32 people, the ministry said. Separately, Israeli strikes in the northern province of Baalbek Hermel killed 21 people and wounded at least 47. Lebanese media reported dozens of strikes in the central, eastern and western Baqa and in the south, besides strikes on Beirut. Israel says it targets militants, but the strikes have hit buildings where civilians were living and the death toll was expected to rise. <laughs> 